I've been um, pondering Psalms 23 lately, and I'm sure so many of you know um, these texts by heart, but I was truly just thinking about today the very first verse in Psalms 23 um, that says, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. That sentence is a beautiful promise, um, just packed full of so many good things. Um, you know, we don't have sheep and shepherds like uh, they used to in ancient times, but you know, like from thousands of years ago, they had shepherds and the job of the shepherd was to tend the sheep, um, to feed them, to lead them to water, to keep them safe, to protect them. And so when the Psalm says, the Lord is my shepherd, I just think, wow, like that's a promise saying that he wants to keep us, guide us, protect us, um, do everything that's necessary so that we can have a safe and good life. And then it also says, you know, we always have a choice. Like God doesn't force anybody Everybody has a choice of who they want to worship or not worship. And the special promise, though, is that when you accept this promise that you want the Lord to be your shepherd, you want to be in his flock, you want him to guide you and lead you and protect you, that he says that you will not want or you will not lack for anything. And that in the world that we live in is just an incredible promise because uh, we live in this world that's just full of wanting and wanting and um, you know trying for this and that like you know you you graduate college and you want the perfect spouse and then you know the American dream says you need to have this beautiful home and then once you have that home uh, you need to upgrade to an even better or bigger home and uh, you need to have uh, the great car and you need to have uh, the perfect vacations and you need to have this and that and this and that and the list goes on and on and on and it's never ending and it's exhausting because um, there'll always be something better, there'll always be something that we don't have that we want to strive for but this verse is saying that the Lord is my shepherd and I shall not want or the Lord is my shepherd I shall not lack he wants to provide everything that you need in your life each and every day so if your life is wanting in any way or lacking in any way, I want to invite you to open up scripture, open up to Psalms 23 and say a prayer and read it and think about it and God will speak to your heart and he will tell you what you need in your life and what he wants to provide for you because he is the good shepherd. And we are sheep that don't know a whole lot and that we need to be guided and tended to and protected. So I'm so thankful today that I have a God who leads me, protects me, and keeps me in his flock because he loves me so much. And he's promised that I'm not going to want for anything or lack for anything. So in this holiday season when it seems like there's just a whole lot of sometimes wanting when that's not what Christmas is supposed to be about. I hope that you will just pare back and simplify and think about what you can do in your life um, to enjoy it, to be grateful, and to think about what you have and what God can give you and what he wants to give you. So I'll talk to you guys soon. I miss you. It's 90 degrees today. <laughs> Talk to you later.